how are you today? I know you're eager to learn our new lesson to discuss today. I am Miss Sophia Grace Abigail D. Rossi, your teacher broadcaster in health tech. I am expecting that you're excited to learn as much as I do. Today, we are going to discuss health professionals, specialists, and health care services. Are you ready? If you are sick, who do you need to call? Your mom, dad, quack doctor, or a doctor. Do you have any idea on this topic? If not, you don't have to worry because we will discuss it for you to understand more about this lesson. Our lesson for today is based on the most essential learning competency of the Department of Education which selects health professionals, specialists, and healthcare services wisely. Objectives for today's lesson. Number one, identify health specialists and healthcare services. And number two, describe health professionals. Let's start. First, let us know what is the term health professional. Health professional license medical practitioners who give credible diagnosis, advices, or information with regards to someone's status. Now, we will learn the different kinds of specialization of health professionals. If we have an eye problem, what doctor should we visit? Yes, we will go to ophthalmologist who specializes in eye and vision care. You have stomach ache or indigestion problem. What doctor should you visit? Gastroenterologist who are trained to diagnose and treat problems in your gastrointestinal tract and liver. For female reproductive system, including pregnancy, menstruation, and fertility issues, what doctor should we go to? Gynecologist who specialize in women's health, including the pregnancy, childbirth, menstruation, and fertility issues, sexually transmitted infections, and hormone disorders. For children ages 0 to 18 years old, if their parents want to keep them healthy, who should they visit? It's pediatrician who manages the physical, behavioral, and mental care for children from birth until age 18. If somebody has a heart failure, what doctor should he go? Cardiologist who specializes in the treatment of heart diseases and heart abnormalities. If you have a skin problem or eczema, whom doctor should you visit? Dermatologist who specializes in conditions involving the skin, hair, and nails. This includes eczema, psoriasis, and skin cancer. Neurologist specialist who treat diseases of the brain, spinal cord, peripheral nerves, and muscles. Orthopedist, a physician who corrects congenital or functional abnormalities of the bones with surgery, casting, and bracing. Pulmonologist, who specializes in the respiratory system. It includes asthma, chronic obstructive lung diseases, COPD, lung cancer, and tuberculosis. Hematologist, a physician who specializes in diagnosing and treating diseases of the blood. Did you learn something? Now, let us go to healthcare facilities. Healthcare facilities are places or institutions that offer healthcare services. First of the healthcare services is hospital. It is an institution where people undergo medical diagnosis, care, and treatment. A hospital offers different types of medical care, like inpatient and outpatient care. There are four kinds of hospital, private, voluntary, government, and teaching. 
Second of the healthcare services is walk-in surgery center. It is a facility that offers surgery without the patient being admitted in the hospital. Third is the health center. The services in a health center cater to a specific population with various health needs. And fourth is the extended health care facility, a facility that provides treatment, nursing care, and residential services to patients, often the elderly. Those are the health professionals, specialists, and health care services. Now you know when you have a health or medical problem, you already know what doctor you should visit. On the next lesson, our topic will be report fraudulent health services. Again, this is Sophia Grace Abigail Zirazi, your teacher broadcaster in Health Tech. Always remember, stay at home and preserve life.